What do we do with our old gadgets when they stop working or if we get a upgrade, as we call it? Some keep them, some discard them, and some turn them into art. Electronic waste is the fastest growing stream of waste in South Africa, with people replacing the old with the new on an ongoing basis. But an art-based initiative known as You Made This is turning your discarded gadgets into art. Joining me now to talk about the initiative is its founder, Dominic Humphrey Arewa, who's in London right now with one of their exhibits. Dominic, thank you so much for your time this morning. Tell us what was the genesis for You Made This. Okay, well, um, we wanted to affect change within the um, consumer behavior and with corporates. And one of the ways that we could work with them was to create work that helps us communicate our message to them. Um, now, we, as we've just said, said there, one of the fastest growing streams of waste is in that space. Uh, what are some of the numbers uh, in that regard? How worried should we be about this particular type of waste? Well, it, it, it's more than, than just numbers. I mean, the problem with the e-waste is that it's incorrectly disposed of. So it mm. ends up in landfills, which affects our water, which affects our land. So things we eat, things we drink. These are things that are um, that the uh, corporations and governments and consumers should all be concerned about because um, it's a major problem for South Africa right now. We are not really advocating for correct disposal of electronics and we are not having the um, uh, a refurbished secondhand use mentality. We always want to buy new and we can't just rely on the corporations to um, assist us with this problem. We have to take things into our, our own hands. Now, we all seem to have that cupboard or drawer in our house where all our old cell phones or old cables and that kind of thing goes into. And the idea behind your initiative is not to say, oh, give us your waste and we'll make something pretty out of it. It's to try and get the attention of people to tell them, let's reduce how much is going into that drawer and what's going into that cupboard in the first place. No, sure. I mean, with assistance from corporations like ABSA and Mimecast, um, they are really um, uh, the pioneers um, um, of this initiative. We also work with a company called Experian, where we um, make um, e-waste bins, which some of our artists make, that we can put in public places that consumers can discard of their uh, redundant electronics. 